Yeah, we both, uh, we grew up playing in our youth worship band. I played drums and John sang. And that's kind of how we started this endeavor of music together. And we started like um, programming beats on our computers and uh, kind of just started writing songs that way and then kind of morphed into what you hear Capital Kings is, you know. I, I made uh, rap beats in high school for all my friends that rapped, so I kind of was like doing more like hip hop rap style. And then... Yeah, I took a, a trip to Europe when I was in high school and, uh, you know, just kind of discovered for myself like house music and ever since I heard that I was just sold. I mean, the feeling and, you know, the way, you know, the, the music made you feel, you know, whether there, you know, whether there was a message or not, you know, there was something about the music, the music style, you know, really spoke to me. Yeah, well, I mean, we just started uh, posting stuff on SoundCloud and YouTube, and uh, we knew some of the people, like, people that were connected to him, and uh, I guess he heard some of the stuff we were doing and really liked what we were about and our sound, and he was like, why don't you all come down to Nashville and see if, uh, see if we can just write some songs and see where it goes, not, like, promising anything. Um, so we went down there. Um, played him some stuff we were working on, which is some of the stuff that was on our first record, and he really liked it. And he was like, "Yo, we'd like to sign you guys and give you a little studio spot down here and see where it goes." Yeah, for sure. I mean, I grew up in the I grew up in the church, and he was basically all I was allowed to listen to. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I was like, "You can listen to Toby Mac, you li or DC Talk back in the day." You can listen to Audio Adrenaline, you know, those types of groups. Um, but at that time, you know, the big thing was, I don't know, they were kind of like, they were the rebels in the industry, you know what I mean? So, I don't know, they spoke they spoke to me at that time. So, I mean, I would say I was, you know, they're one of the reasons why I'm in music, you know, to begin with, so. Well, we knew we wanted something different that we've ever done. We never really done like a straight trap EDM song. And when uh, we were over at my house one day and we were kind of struggling like with where we wanted to get it. And all of a sudden we, it was just like, I pulled up a sound, played that line and it was like, yes. That, I mean, it was basically done from that point on. And then we knew we wanted to, to get a rapper on it. Uh, I think first, we were thinking about who we wanted and then we knew we wanted someone from the reach camp though and we were really into kb and what he's all about right now i just think he's killing it so we reached out to them asked him to get on the track and he, he was down so it was really cool it came together last minute but it worked out great